So today we are doing a challenge video between me and Jazzball to see who can get more matches on Tinder in 24 hours. Right off the bat, leave a comment down below. Who do you think is gonna win, me or Jazzball? I yeah. wonder who's gonna win. I, I, do, I asked people on Twitter and everybody was saying you. Nobody likes a sweet, kind-hearted kid. They always like the asshole. How this is gonna work, we have both deleted and wiped all the information off of our Tinders. There is no memory, no history, no Facebook account, like nothing, and we are gonna have a fresh start. The hundreds of matches I had are all gone. What if my wife was in there? How many matches did you lose? I had about two matches. But they were really nice people. Uncle, that, 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 do you message them? I don't message them, I get scared. <laughs> <laughs> we are gonna see today who is better at Tinder. How this is gonna work, we're both gonna get Tinder Plus and we're both gonna get 24 hours with a new Tinder account to get as many matches as possible. There are a couple of rules though, Mr. Jazz. So you have to pay for Tinder Plus? No, you have to pay for both of us. You already know my credit card information. On, on my credit card statement, it says that you every month you're subscribed to this porn magazine or something like that, I don't know, and my mom thinks it's me. I only go online to watch porn. Couple of rules. The first rule is for the first three hours of it, we are only going to be able to have one picture of our face and no bio. And we're actually going to take that picture right now, and you only get one shot at taking the picture. You probably should have shaved. I'm just going to say that right now. Ah! I'm going to make this video today. I would have shaved. Socks. What are you doing? You only get one shot at this first picture. You get to take one picture and that is the picture you use. No retakes, no Photoshop. Camera roll. No camera. <laughs> not camera roll. You don't get to pick anything. Guys, I don't really like take selfies. I mean, if you guys follow me on Instagram at Derek underscore Gerard, you know I have a bomb ass selfie game. And I actually just posted this selfie right here, which you guys can go like and comment the flame on my- What are you- Oh, you thought your face was being covered by the picture? Oh god, please don't. <laughs> don't, don't. If you, if you push that button, it counts, Chazball. Push that button, damn it! You look like you have a broken neck. <laughs> I don't know what to look at. Do I look at the camera? Or like, do I look Come at the on, one selfie! <laughs> okay, there he goes. Damn, my shoulder's in your picture! God, now people are gonna think you have friends. That's cheating. Can redo that? No, you can't redo it. That is what Jazz Ball's Tinder profile is gonna look like for the first three hours. Now it's my turn. When you're taking a selfie, okay, there's many things you have to take into accommodate, consider medation. Yeah, you get like a half smirk, maybe like a half smirk with like a little wink on the face. You definitely should have gone first. That could have. <laughs> So we are now going to split up. Jazz Paul has his camera that he has on right now, and that's what he's going to be using for his video, and I have my camera. We're going to disperse, have our own strategy. This is really a... Oh my god, which camera do I use? <laughs> After three hours of just the picture, we're gonna be able to add a bio, and then after three more hours, so six hours from now, you're gonna be able to do anything you want with your Tinder account. Any pictures, any bio, or you wanna link your Instagram account. We will meet back here tomorrow at 12.40 p.m. That's what the time is right now, and we will see who has more matches. You're going down! I probably will. All right, you guys, so I just got back from Derek's house. Not gonna lie, I've never really used Tinder before. I'm not really sure how to use it properly. So um, let's just get to it here. Okay, so I already got Tinder Plus. So my age range, 18 to 32. Uh, I think I want to go lower. 25, I think, would be the best option for me. 18 to 25 is what I'm looking for. I want to find the right person, and I think that's it. I don't know how well this will do, because... <laughs> My strategy for this video is just to swipe, swipe, swipe until my fingers are bleeding. I actually tried to order something online for this specific video, but they don't sell them anymore, unfortunately. It's called the Tinder finger that you plug into your phone and just continuously swipes right, but they unfortunately don't sell them anymore. Right now my age range is 18 to 32, but we're gonna crank that all the way up to uh, 18 to 55 plus. Maximum distance? Oh, I'll go to a girl that's on the moon if I have to. And you guys would think right now I'd be starting to swipe and just get as many matches as possible, but I am not going to swipe for at least the next three hours because right now I don't have a bio and my profile is completely naked. So what's the point of me swiping? I'm gonna wait till I have a bio so that's a lot more likely that I'll get matches. And also in the picture I have, my gum is sticking out of my mouth. So I'm not gonna swipe very much until I can change that picture. Maybe, I, oh, maybe I should, I'm, I'm gonna work on some fo- Oh, I know what I'm gonna do! Alright then, let's just start swiping right, I guess. Uh, I'm eight months pregnant with triplets, and I need a rich man to marry. Um, I don't think that's for me, unfortunately. Nature and art enthusiast, looking to meet new people. R Ravina? I, I, I can respect you being a student. Sure. Christina, looks like Christina Aguilera. Wow. And she goes to university too, so yeah, it's a fair, it's a fair thing, yeah. Elizabeth23 to Wasson. 
Sure. Fun Korean from Bay Area, currently on the verge of death from loneliness. Um, that's a bit sad. Let's see, Signe, you're actually 17. Um, okay, that's a, uh, what? Travel, photography, music, so... Oh my god, start listening to Chris music on the November 1st. Super like Meg, yeah. Because later on I'm gonna get to post any pictures I want on my Tinder, I am going to tweet out this photo of my face and ask you guys for somebody to Photoshop this face onto a jacked body and I'll shout out whoever does it. Tweet that, and that will get sent out, and then now if somebody replies to that with a picture of me jacked, I'll use it on my Tinder later on in the day. Jazzball's a really nice guy and being the guy that he is, for this video he's probably just gonna make a legit Tinder profile and I'm excited to to see how much I beat him by with my tactics. Um, I like people from university, Sunbridge University, that's cool. Mega Babes Club, 1995. 95 is my number. She goes to the gym. Perfect. I have nothing against girls who don't go to the gym. Uh, I just I go to the gym and I think it'd be cool to have a gym a workout buddy. Shift supervisor at Starbucks. Is it shallow to say that I really like Starbucks? So if I knew someone who worked there, I'd get free discounts and stuff. So all oh, pizza, automatic like. It's a lot of work, honestly. It is a lot of work to keep swiping right for these people. And I know I want to find the one, but I keep swiping. It's I don't know how people do this all the time. It's just too much for me. I can't do it. Alright, I think that's it for me swiping right for uh, for now. When I get when I'm able to update my bio, I think people will really realize how sweet and sensitive and kind of really young because i gotta explain that in my bio that, that's what really give me the extra edge on finding the right person for me so yeah i'll um i'll get back to you guys in a couple hours so all i'm doing right now is preparing for the time when i can do anything i want with the cinder profile if there's one thing girls on tinder like it's puppies i just raided my entire facebook page all my photos and i had i don't have any pictures with a puppy but i do have a friend who has a puppy so right now i'm gonna head over to his house take a picture with his puppy pretend it's my puppy and win this challenge! He said the only way he'd let me take a picture with his puppy is if I bought a McDonald's, so I have to go buy a McDonald's, so, um... Yeah, I have great friends, guys! This guy's lucky I need a picture with a puppy, otherwise I would not be doing this right now! What is this, Uber Eats? A Here! Thanks, pal! Oh my god, he's so cute! How many girls has he gotten you? <laughs> Zero. Hold him, like, under, like, there. Make sure he's supported. Alright. That was a huge success. I got a picture with not only a puppy, but also a bunny. And those are gonna be going on my Tinder profile later. And that's, gonna, I'm gonna win. There's no way I can lose with those pictures. Oh my God, you guys. Okay, I just got a match. Just got a match before my even, but I'm so surprised. I did not think this was gonna happen. Oh, she's wearing Gucci. Never been in this situation before, you guys. I don't know what to think right now. Uh, what do I do? I don't even know what to do. Ah! I cannot mess this up. I cannot mess this up. Oh my God, please. Yeah! Around six o'clock, the rules are that we can add more photos. So I'm thinking I should like take some photos now, prepare myself. Look at that. Look at that little cutie. Friends in the background there too. I think I should put some friends in there too. Uh, uh, that's one of my favorite shows of all time. Eee! I look high as hell. Let's see here. What else can I do? I like cooking, you guys. Uh, I'm not good at it, but you know what? I like to put the effort in, try new things. I guess I should take some pictures of me trying to cook so that ladies know that I can cook for them, come home from a hard day's work, and just a nice gourmet meal is placed right in front of them when they walk in the house. Hey! Much better! I like friends. I put the Christmas tree up because I love Christmas. Why not? Made sure that they, she knows that I, I, I'm a really good cook. Aw, is that cute? With a Mickey Mouse mug? I only did that so she knows that I enjoy Disney. Who doesn't like Disneyland? One day, I will be taking that one lucky lady to Disneyland. Alright, you guys. So, another picture I was going to take was with my Ronaldo jersey. But, um... I think you all know what happened to that. I think I should take a picture with uh, King Leo. Hopefully that will get quite a few matches on my side. I'm gonna call Jazz pull up, see how he's doing, and just let him know that we can now add a bio. All right. Oh, Derek's calling me right now. Hello? Hey, baby. I was just gonna message this girl that I matched with. You got, you got, how many matches have you gotten? One. You, you'll, <laughs> you only got one match? Why? How, how many times, get? how many girls have you swiped for? Like, I don't know, 30? Jasper, you had three hours you swipe for 30 girls. It's hard work, okay? What do you want me to do? You're just trying to get as many matches as possible. What have you been doing? Well, I mean, I okay, so I matched with this one girl and I, and I was trying to think of like, something to message her. I didn't know, I-, I You don't ha it doesn't matter what, you don't have to message them. You just need to get matches, that's all that matters. But I wanted to find my true love. Oh my gosh, Jazz Paul, you need to just start swiping like crazy if you want any chance of winning. This is who can get more matches, not who can find the love of their life. This isn't The Bachelor. Maybe for you it isn't, but I thought it could be. Oh my. No one besides me will ever love you. It's not nice to say at all. I'm gonna go and try and get some matches, and uh, you should probably do the same, so I'll talk to you later. Bye. Okay, bye.
You know what? He is right. Every single time, I always mess up on a challenge. I never win. And this is, I am going to win this. I am going to try my hardest. I'm going to think of the best bio possible. So I think I can get matches very, very easily with this. All right, so I am now going to add a bio to my Tinder profile. I can't really do too much because all I have is that stupid picture with the gum in my mouth, but I thought I'd use that to my advantage. Okay, so I'm trying to think of something involving gum, maybe like a pun, like uh, this is, picture is really gummy. That's freaking stupid. You should gum over to my house. No. <laughs> I know you can see the gum in my mouth, but I can see myself in your pants. Yes! When you look at it, it kind of looks like not only a piece of gum, but also a loose tooth. So maybe... Okay, I know what I'm gonna do. A loose tooth or gum question mark. Swipe right to find out. This is giving people an initiative to swipe right to find out. I mean, it, it's obviously a piece of gum, but they don't know that. So maybe this will help me in the long run. Now we're just going to keep on Harding this everybody is I, I you know what I'm an open and loving person. I love everybody Everybody's probably doesn't love me. Okay. I'm kind of getting tired of tapping. Let's try the swipe action No tapping's way faster. Oh gosh, my freaking battery's getting low. I'm only at 38% I'm gonna have to charge up. This is not the most comfortable thing to do. Oh, there was just cleavage that flew by All right, you guys I just finished working on my tinder bio. What I wrote is um hi My name is Jazz and I'm just a fun loving person who just loves life think of myself as a very kind person who would do anything for anybody I don't like Hitler, racism, war, disease, or people who go to McDonald's and order a salad. Honestly, I'm just trying to find my one true love on here. Also, I don't mean to brag, but our first date will definitely be at McDonald's because I want to make you feel like the luckiest girl in the whole wide world. I think it's pretty smart. You know, that's, 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 good. that's a good line, isn't it? I think so. Yeah, I think I honestly will get a lot of matches with this. If not, I just poured my heart out to a lot of girls on Tinder and they will know that I am a giant pussy. For now, all I can do is stick with the bio and go to different locations. Sarah told me that you go to different locations, you get more of a chance of getting girls. I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go downtown. Hopefully there, I'll be able to get more matches. Just gonna drive over there right now. All right, you guys, I just got to uh, downtown. And I have to start swiping right a lot more now too. That's what he said. You know what guys, this doesn't feel right. I think I'm just objectifying women if I keep swiping right all the time. And you know, uh, it doesn't, it's just not me. I don't feel right when I'm doing this. So what I think I'm gonna try doing is um, actually doing it the way I was doing it before. You know, look at the bios and try to find the right person for me. <laughs> Good. The good thing about having Tinder Plus is you can also change your location so I'm not only stuck to using the city that I live in, which is Vancouver. After I've done all the swiping in Vancouver, I could like tap over here and go to like to Seattle. And now I will match with people who live in Seattle instead of just Vancouver. And I, again, guys, I love, I'm a loving person. I love all shapes, sizes, skin, genders, whatever you are, I will like you and I will try and match with you. I actually have to use the bathroom, but I will not stop swiping for anything. Oh gosh, how am I going to wipe my butt, hold the camera and... Guess I'm not wiping today! I'm swiping so fast it's not even loading people's pictures anymore, but I mean, who, I, don't, I, I love everybody, guys. I don't need to see what you look like. All I care about is that you match with me and I win this competition. So I've been in Seattle for quite a while. I think I did at least 100 people, so now I'm gonna move on to Calgary, Alberta, Canada. I tried my best to explain this whole location thing to Jazz Paul. I'm not sure if he understood it completely, but I don't I don't know what he's doing right now. All right, guys, I just got to an another location where it's supposed to be really heavily populated. Hopefully, I'm gonna, I'm gonna find my luck here. Re Marissa. Marissa. I think what it is, if she's 22, automatic match for me. GG, 22. Oh, she has a glass filter, so why not? Going out clubbing too? Cool. Send nudes. Uh -huh, she's hilarious. Rose has a picture of herself on the shirt she's wearing. That is my type of girl. Yeah, all right, you guys. That's it for me for the location stuff for now. And hopefully, if I put more photos on, I'll be able to get more matches because right now, I'm not getting anything. Been swiping in Calgary for a bit, just lying in bed listening to music. This video is actually pretty fun. It's really relaxing. It's not that difficult and it's pretty mindless to just keep tapping your finger. But I'm now moving from Calgary to San Francisco. I can just lay here and swipe, but I could also probably get some stuff done while I'm doing this instead of just wasting time swiping. The way we're doing this, all we're trying to do is get matches. So I don't have to look at the profiles or anything, so maybe I should do some stuff. It is now 6.25, which means it is 15 minutes until me and Jazz Paul can do anything we want with our Tinder accounts. And I actually have a little surprise for Jazz Paul. So, so I went on YouTube and I found this video called, This Video Will Crash Any iPhone. I, this is not cheating, okay? There were no rules against making somebody's phone break. 
Even though if Jasper did that to me, I would call it cheating, but it's okay. So this guy on YouTube named Everything Apple Pro has a video that you can send to your friend on iMessage and after they open it, it'll crash their phone. So being that in 15 minutes, it is the most important part of this competition. Like you can do whatever you want to your account. That's gonna get you the most matches. I'm going to send Jasper this video on iMessage and he will always open anything I send him because I'm sending him like links to funny pictures and images all the time. And once he opens it, his phone will crash. The way to get your phone back up and working is to plug it into a charger, but I don't know if Janice Paul is gonna know that and it might take him a while to realize that that's what he has to do. <sighs> Hopefully this works. Okay, so it is now 640, which means Janice Paul is probably right about to start making his real Tinder profile. I'm about to send him the URL right now so that it'll crash his phone. I'm hiding it as a Google short link just because the original link looks a little bit sketchy, but hopually this still works. I'm pretty sure it does. Okay, it's been sent. Now, hopefully he's gonna open that and his phone will crash. I don't even know if he's gonna be able to contact me because, wait, yeah, this, he can't even call me to complain about it because his phone is gonna be crashed, so. <laughs> I'm gonna start putting together my real Tinder profile. I'm gonna quickly go through Twitter and see if any of you guys made a decent Photoshop of me with abs. There's the post, let's scroll down to the first one is from who, oh my god. Oh my god! <laughs> Eat my memes. Um, that doesn't look terrible, but I mean, it. Um, <laughs> I'm gonna save that. Oh my gosh, what the hell is that? <laughs> Handsome shirtless man stock photo. <laughs> it's just my uh, K-pop waifu fan sends me on a stripper pole. That one's actually not that bad. Okay, uh, did, co come on. So, okay. All right, you guys, just a quick update. Derek just sent me a text message and it was a link to open some, I don't know, it was a link to something. And I opened it and my phone just crashed. So it's not working right now. So I don't know what to do right now. Uh, I'm gonna have to call Derek and tell him to pause the event or something. Or, uh, it's not fair, I'm losing Tinder time right now. All right, you guys, I'm just calling Derek right now on my home phone. Hello? Yo, what'd you send me? Jazz pole? Yeah, my phone crashed. Your phone crashed? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> what do you mean your phone crashed? My phone crashed. You sent me this link and I opened it up and, and it just died. What did I, I send you like a funny picture? What do you mean if your phone crashed? I don't know what. Derek, whatever what you, you sent me, my, it, it's crashed my phone. Are you serious? Dude, we have to Dude, pa pause, the, pause the challenge or something. We, I, I can't even access my phone right now. Like your phone's just not working? No, it's not. It's completely dead. Well, that sucks for you. I mean, we can't pause the challenge. I mean, you're just gonna have to- What do you mean? To... Yeah, we can! <laughs> That makes no you, sense. It's a 24 hour, ch it's not my fault your phone just stopped working. That's that's a that's a bridge you'll have to get over and freaking figure out what to do. That's totally unfair, what the hell? Is the is the store open? Is the Apple store open? You go there. Uh, no it's not, it's closed now. Well, I guess you're just out of luck, Jazz Paul. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm busy over here swiping away. I, I mean, it's 6.40 now, so we can do whatever we want with our account, so I'm making my time. You're wasting my time. What are you talking about? What? Dude, you sent me something, my phone crashed, and now I can't even use Tinder now. What? The, well, well, how's that helpful? That's not. What the maybe, hell are you maybe you me. How? Wow. Okay. Well, I'm glad you think of me as that as a friend. I would sabotage you. I'm trying to make a fun video of us on Tinder, trying to get matches. I see how you feel about me. You know what? Good luck trying to fix your phone. I'm not gonna help you because you know what? You think of me as an asshole, and that's not cool, Jazzball. Have fun finding nobody because your phone's broken. This is perfect. Okay, he hung this is up great. on me. This is awesome. Now we are gonna finish the profile and we are gonna get all the matches and Jazz Paul's gonna have none. <laughs> what the hell? What am I gonna do now? All right, you guys, I guess I'm just gonna have to Google it to figure it out. Hopefully I find a solution. I'll check back with you guys then. 15 minutes later and my profile is complete. Let's see what you guys think. We will start off with the pictures. It opens up with a nice picture of me with the bunny and then you go scroll over and it hits you with the, oh! Wait, adult diaper and a French maid outfit? What is wrong with this guy? Swipe over again. <gasps> it's a puppy! Swipe over again. He's like, oh, okay. He's doing a nice greeting. One more time. It's like, okay, he has friends. That's nice. And lastly, the photo... <laughs> <laughs> if they get this far, they definitely already like me, so there's no point in me putting something serious here, and this looks awesome. This is where I become kind of a douchebag, and I say have over 650,000 subscribers on YouTube, so I can't really be that bad. I am six feet tall, which, of course, is a lie. I am five foot eleven. I enjoy a good coffee, and yes, you can pet my dog, even though it's not mine. And in real life, I would never flex on how many YouTube subscribers I have and lie about my height and the fact that I have a dog. This is all for the purpose of winning the competition, okay? 
I mean, I do kind of lie and say I'm six feet tall, but five foot eleven and a half. I'm, I'm basically six feet. All right, guys, I spent over an hour on the computer trying to figure out how to like fix my phone, and I couldn't find anything. I just thought, you know, let's try plugging it into a charger, and you know what? Boom! That's right, Derek. I'm coming for you. He tried to sabotage me. I know he did. I know he tried to sabotage me. You know what? Justice always wins at the end. I don't know what that meant, but. Hopefully it means something good. So now I'm able to change photos, change my bio and everything. I'm already, I'm set with that. And I can also put on, connect my Instagram too. Um, let's see how it looks. Boom, 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 boom. And you guys already know what my Tinder profile is all about. So the trick is to always just keep going, keep going. I don't know what else I can do. Hopefully my bio is set. I put my Instagram up there. Maybe I will find the love of my life. And if not, hopefully I do get more matches than Derek because he did cheat. Hopefully this turns out really well for me. And I finally meet somebody and I don't have to hang out with Derek every single day of my life. My phone is getting so hot because I've been swiping for literally like an hour straight. What I'm gonna do now is go to bed, but I'm not going to sleep anytime soon. I have some South Park loaded up on my computer and I have a can of Red Bull that's bigger than my head. For the next however long I can stay awake for with this Red Bull, I am gonna be swiping on Tinder. I don't even care if the sun comes up. I'm gonna swipe until I can't swipe anymore. If I don't win this competition, Jazz Paul must have some sort of secret tactic that he is using that I have no idea about. All right, you guys. Just finished taking a shower like what 11 51 p.m. I'm gonna DM that girl that I matched with so far as you can see I only have one match right now pretty sure that's way more than what Derek has There's no way he has one match already. I mean, it's only been like a couple hours gonna DM her and see what she says And hopefully by tomorrow I'll have more matches. Have a little bit of a little winky face <laughs> Perfect sent it. I'm gonna see what happens. Hopefully um, I get a response back, maybe find the love of my life. I'll see you guys tomorrow. A few time lapse of me drinking way too much caffeine in bed, swiping on Tinder all night long. <laughs> Good morning, guys. Uh... As you can tell, I just woke up. Check those matches. I'm pretty sure I got way more this time. All right, so I got nothing so far. Hopefully she responded back. Uh... Um, she, she unmatched with me. Well, I have no more matches now. Derek wouldn't have gotten that many matches in one, like, what, in one day? No way. I know my mom's room right now. She doesn't want me to show her face because she just woke up. The girl, I matched a girl yesterday. I matched with a girl on, on Tinder yesterday and she unmatched with me. So. Really? Yeah. What girl would want to match with you anyways? The next clip you'll see is me at Derek's house, probably. I'm thinking of a story now. God damn it. I'll think of something. If there's one thing I'm good at, it's bullshit. I mean, uh, telling a stretched out truth. All right, you guys, just got to Derek's house right now. I'm gonna get a five by one bar. Oh my god. Still asleep? Energy drink too? Must have been up really late last night. 12.40 now, you guys. Derek! Dude, it's 12.40. Yeah. How many matches did I get? Not that I many? I lost. Really? Oh my gosh, how freaking late was- Dude, you were up really late. So I guess it's time to see who won. Oh god, I was up all night and I'm still gonna freaking lose. I think it might be a tie. Oh, you got me a freaking thing. No, what? Oh, That's mine. All right, so it is now 12, it is 12.45, 24 hours after we started this competition. I was up all night swiping right. Like, I don't even know when I fell asleep. Like, my freaking thumb is cramping right now from what I was doing last night. So, I mean, if you tied with me, I, I think you probably beat me. I didn't even get that many matches for 24 hours. What is your, what is, was your profile good? My profile was like top notch, I dude. Mine, I got picture. I went and got pictures with a bunny and a puppy. I think my profile was good for me. But like, if I was me, I would probably like maybe consider dating me. After 24 hours of me swiping all day and like making my profile just dedicated to getting swipes, I got only 88 matches, which honestly I think is kind of pathetic. Jaswell probably has me beat. So 24 hours. Like that's not that's not that good. So how many did you beat me by? Um, yeah. I had about eighty thousand. Um, sorry, not eighty thousand, eight hundred. But you sent me that virus and it messed up my entire phone. I tried to recover all those matches. I lost them all. You see, you got eight hundred matches. Yeah, eight hundred matches. So okay, well, did you at least take? A, you probably took a screenshot of all the matches. I ah, oh, you should have told me that, dude. I didn't know. Like that virus really messed up, and I tried recovering him, and then I just somehow I I ended up matching with guys, and then I had to go on dates with guys too. I went on four dates with guys last night. Well, if it messed up your phone, let me see how many matches you have now. I I on right now I have. 
Right, I have zero matches right now. You messed up my phone, and now I have nothing. I did up. not, Jazzboy. Yeah, you messed up my phone. I had 700 matches. I just said you had 800. Sorry, 801. Yeah, eight, 700, 801. What, what do you it? want me to say, Derek? I had. I want you to tell the truth, and you can tell me that you got none. I didn't have none. I had one. You had one match. 100. You had 100 matches. All right, I had one match. Okay. It's not my fault. So you went 24 hours and got one match. And she got matches. <laughs> so I clearly won this competition. After 24 hours, I got 88 matches on Tinder. Jazz Paul got one. It's probably that virus you sent me. But how'd you get 88 matches then? Because not only was I swiping here, I was in San Francisco, LA, Seattle, Calgary. I went everywhere. How'd you go? How'd you go anywhere? In one night? You can change your look. I told you you can change your location on the app. No, you didn't! I told you that before we started filming! Thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you want to see us do more challenges of Derek versus Jazz Paul, be sure to kick that like button down below and let us know what we should do. We will see you all in the next video. Have a fantastic day. Always remember the motto of do good, die great. Don't cry, Jazz Paul. I'm gonna, I'm gonna help you out with your Tinder profile. I'm gonna get you lots of matches. You're gonna get a nice big fat c in your ass. Don't try and act sad. Like, it's, it's, I am it's sad! It's nobody's fault but your own. You cheated! I didn't cheat! Get over yourself! I'll never find the perfect one for me. He was supposed to be the Mrs. 95. Uh, uh, <laughs> <laughs> we will see you all in the next video. Have a fantastic day. Be sure to subscribe if you're new. And we'll see you very soon. Alright, see ya. Yes, I am that stupid. <laughs>